Statue Hunter 75 here with the PBC statue figure, whatever you want to call it, from a company from Japan called Koto Bukiya. I reviewed their Batman and their Superman earlier. And it's by Koto Bukiya and Art FX. Same company that did those other two. Um, this is a little different, but this is anime. I'm not really big into anime. But I saw this piece on eBay and I loved it. It reminds me a lot of my girlfriend. So it's just really cute. And it's a really nice little piece. Just a lot of detail in it too. It's really cool. Um, the face has some pretty good features like detail like the green eyes and pretty good paint job by Kotobukiya. On some of the anime pieces the paint isn't that great but it's pretty cool here like the fades and the tones and everything. The pen is loose. This arm is a switch out arm. Um, basically you can either have the arm with it like this with the pen up at her lips or you can also have just another arm right here with uh, the arm just on her lap. I like it better with the pen. Looks cuter. And there's also an extra hair piece that you can pop in the back of her head. It's a pain in the butt to get off, so I left this hair. I like that hair better anyway. It looks like my girlfriend's. But this hair in the back kind of sits on the back of it. Um, the character is called Maresan. It's by a famous Japanese artist. He also does a lot of out for video games and stuff like that in Japan. His name is uh, Shunya Yamashita. And um, he's kind of like the Adam Hughes of Japan, I guess. He does all these like little sexy anime girls. Also, this is loose too, the, the shoe that is like cutely dangling off the foot. The high heel or whatever you want to call it. That's loose and you can just hang it. You can either set it down or hang it. If you try and make it fit on her foot, it doesn't exactly fit that good. That's the way it's supposed to be right there, dangling off her toe like that. And she's not connected to the seat. You can actually lift her from the shoe's gonna fall, of course. There's little imprints for where her hand goes and her hips go on the chair. And the chair is like fully swiveling. <laughs> it's like a real office chair, it's pretty cool. And this is not numbered or anything. I'll give it a little spin around so you can see it. Make sure she's on there. It's not numbered at all, um, like most Kotobukiya pieces that are P PVC pieces, they're not numbered. This um, sells for a lot of money. I just saw one sell on eBay for like $165. When it first came out, I think it was $49.99. Um, I picked this one up for $80 on eBay. It's just really popular, really popular with uh, all his characters. He does a lot of other characters, but this is like his most po one of his most popular characters. It sells for a lot. I don't know if I showed you the box. It's basically the box. I'll just give it a quick, that's the box. That's how it's displayed with her in there. And then there's that too. And that's the back. So this is Statue Hunter 75 with uh, a really cute piece by Shunya Yamashita and it's made, manufactured by, uh, distributed by Kotobukiya and Artifacts.